Okay, so the next ice cream is Starbucks, and I was actually surprised they um, made a flavor without coffee, but they do. It's um, a vanilla bean frappuccino. I actually um, really like the packaging style of this one. It's very reminiscent of um, their cups in the store. It's very familiar, and that's nice when you're buying ice cream, so you know what it is. And the top is kind of neat. It, it just like shows the ice cream inside, so you know what you're going to get and everything. Now, the Starbucks ice cream is actually pretty good because it only has um, 10 ingredients, so it's a little bit better than dryers. It doesn't have any corn syrup, which I like. Um, it has 11 grams of fat, 20 grams of sugar, and 200 calories for a serving, which is a half cup. And so, let's taste it. You can actually see the vanilla bean in this one, unlike the past two in dryers and meadow gold, which means there probably actually is vanilla bean in here, which is nice. Okay, um, well it definitely has a good texture, the texture is very nice, um, very smooth and creamy but not too overpowering. <clears throat> so I'm going to give the texture a four and a half, that was really nice, it was quite delicious. These have used to open, it was pretty simple, didn't have any plastic covering on the top, and all that was on there was the little plastic ring around it, and that was pretty easy to get off. The taste, overall, it's interesting because it reminds me a little bit of a soy ice cream, or a, a rice cream ice cream. And, um, I'm not exactly sure why that is. I don't know, it kind of throws me a little bit. The flavor isn't the greatest thing. It's not terrible. So we're going to give the flavor maybe like a three and a half. It's decent. It's better than the hydrocodose corn syrup kind of sticky gummy flavors that you get from those first two ice creams. So I'm going to give that three and a half for the flavor. Um, fat content is 11 grams, which is a bit more than dryers and metal gold, but again, this has um, cream and milk and everything in it. So I'm going to give that maybe a three, three and a half. Sugar content. Um, the Starbucks has 20 grams of sugars, um, which is actually quite a bit with all these three ice creams. It's the second highest. I'll give that a three. It's not the best. Natural artificial flavoring. It's all natural. They use vanilla beans and vanilla extract. So I'm going to give that I'm gonna give that a four. But they did pretty well on that. For cholesterol in this ice cream, this has 55 milligrams, so it's the highest of all of them right now. Not so good. I'm going to give that a one for cholesterol. Attractiveness of container, I already went over this. I really like this style of container. I'm going to give that a 5. The ingredients. Ingredients in this were decent. I'm going to give that a 3. And the taste overall was, it was good. I mean, compared to the rest of them, I was going to get a 3.5.